Here we have a Super Nintendo Mini Classic Mini. Classic Mini. This was bought faulty from eBay, and if I remember rightly, the listing said it had no signs of power and did not display on the TV. In fact, here it is right here. No output on TV when connected or signs of power in good cosmetic condition. Which is true. Well, I'm saying it's true, it's in good condition. Let's try and plug it in. I think it's got a an LED on it. Yeah, it has so power, no power. And nothing on the TV. Okay. Easy diagnosis. Let's try and take it apart. I'm guessing we've got screws under these little rubber feet. I guessed correctly. Right, so while I'm defooting this, let's, get, let's give a shout out to this week's Holy Hand Grenade patrons. Tidder, Ellis Garbutt. Sorry, one of the feet just pinged off. And Jamrag Berlin. Found it. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, wow. Nice. Little ribbon cable. Um, did I just pull out? Yep, it does. That was easy. Right, so what could we have? We could have a problem with the switch. Or we could have a problem with the power. Let's check the switch first. Always check the easiest things. Beeping device on. Oh, hang on. They're, they're all connected to each other. What's, what's going on? And that's off. So on. Right, I don't understand that. So the the bottom two aren't connected, but the, t the, the middle and the top are when it's on. And when it's off, all three of them are connected. Am I being stupid here? Not for the first time. I don't get it. Well, it's doing something different in the two positions, isn't it? Oh, hang on. The port doesn't look great. Maybe the switch is fine and I'm just being an idiot. It's really hard to get this at the right angle. But something about that just does not look right to me. It looks like there's no pins there. There's not, is there? That port... There's no pins. Yeah, there's no pins. That's it, isn't it? Hmm. Right, I'm going to have to get this board out. Right, well, let's try and take this out. We've got a couple of connectors there for the controllers. And we've got four screws. That's probably easier now. Oh, hang on. I think someone's at... Oh, my good God. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to get this under the microscope. You ready for this? Here it comes. Da, 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 da. That is what my great friend Northridge Fix would call a Hiroshima bomb. What on earth? I mean, I know I'm not the best, but this is just ridiculous. Uh, I was going to get my multimeter out just to see if any of those are shorting together, but... <laughs> Look at the state of it! Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. Right, well, I think it's uh, safe to say that that's, that's the problem right there. Um... I wonder whether they've tried to get the, this one off and and failed and just given up. Or whether that is a new one that they've tried to solder on. Either way, it's still funny. Uh, oh dear. Am I going to have a replacement one of those? Probably not. What's actually slightly worrying is the case here is all black. Like it's something's burnt out. 
but it is around where the port is. I mean, good grief. It's pretty, it's pretty bad. I, I wouldn't be surprised if that hasn't done more damage on this board somewhere. I mean, everything's shorting, but yeah, that's probably to be expected. I'm going to have to take this port off and just see if, what the damage is like underneath. Wow. Let's add some leaded solder here. <laughs> I mean that might be leaded solder already yeah I think it is wow I'm just going to uh, go ahead and whack this with a bit of uh, hot air The river of solder is melting. Wow. Let's try and clean it up. Is that a hole there? Hmm. I'm slightly worried by that. That does look like a hole. How has that happened? How is there a hole? Someone's probably soldered that on, thought, oh, I've done a good job there, plugged it in. It's all shorted it together <laughs> and some fire and burnt the hole through the board. So I'm assuming that that's ground anyway. So that's a ground, 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 and ground. So they're all still ground. The one next to it is presumably not supposed to be a ground. Well, that's still okay. And that one goes to there. What's K? That's not a fuse, is it? Wow. Sorry, I keep saying wow, but just wow. Alright, well, I need to order some USB ports because I don't have any. Unless I can take one off something else. Thinking about it, I should be able to use my bench, bench power supply to put... I mean, it's only these two pins, isn't it, that are required. That's ground and that's the, the power. I'm going to do that and see if it comes on. Because if it doesn't, it might be wasting my time. Right, I've just had an idea. So I've got these little charger boards. And it's micro USB. And it's obviously 5 volts. And then we've got a plus and minus here. So if I just plug a USB in there and connect some cables up to here and solder them on here, it'll be a bit of a bodge, but at least it'll show me whether it's going to work or not. Does that make sense? Yeah, so you use these to charge up batteries. And obviously the batteries connect at this end here. The USB port goes in here. But at this minus and this plus here, we're just getting it directly from the relevant pins on the port. So I can just solder a couple of wires onto here. So I'm going to do that. board back in. Let's just solder it to here. <laughs> An exquisite piece of soldering there Stephen. But who cares. It, it's on. Right so let's plug the micro USB into the little charger board. Right, we should now have 5 volts going there. Right, so that isn't working. I suspect that the fuse has gone. Well, you would hope it would with that mess that was there, wouldn't you? Let's have another look at it. Right, so I've taken the power wire off. 
and this here, there's no continuity through it. So if the power's coming in here and it's not travelling through, it's not going to go anywhere else, is it? Uh, I obviously don't have a replacement one of these. Well, not obviously, but I don't. I'm very tempted to jump it, but I just don't want to do any more damage. I wonder if a Nintendo Switch charging port fuse would work. I'm going to have a look. I've got, I've got some somewhere. There's one. Yep, yeah, same size, isn't it? Yeah, I think I'm going to try that. Let's take that one off and see if we can pop that one on. Let's just check to see if we're going from here to here. Yes, we are. Right. I'll let that cool down and we'll try it again. Hmm. All right, I'm just going to try looking at this under the thermal camera. And let's see if anything gets hot. Oh. Yeah, that's hot. Right, let's have a look, see what that chip is. So it's this one here, AXP223. Don't know what that is, but let's check around it, see if anything's shorting. Uh, yep, that one is. And that one is the top one. So there's definitely a couple of shorts around there. Right, it's a power management IC. So that is very possibly blown because of the mess that was on the USB port. Uh, I think I'm going to take it off. Couple of bridges there. I'll just get rid of. Okay, right. Let's see. Those caps are still shorting. Yes, they are. Right. So the chances are that chip might be okay. I hope this has not fried the CPU. Ah, we've got a short there. So the middle one's supposed to be ground. But they're not, are they? They're meant to be display lines. That one's okay. Yes, we've got a short here. Into this chip as well. So is that the chip? The filter? <laughs> Something before it? I'm going to struggle with this one, I think. I tell you what, before I lose it, I'm gonna put I'm gonna put that chip back on. There we go. Job is a good one. What else could it be? Would you add them and eve it? Shorts have gone. Surely a bad filter could not have been causing the rest of that. Yeah, shorts are not there anymore. But let's see, have they gone? No, oh, so they are still there as well. That filter's got nothing to do with it, but it has. It was obviously shorted. 
Right, I'm just going to inject one volt into this area where the short is and see if I can see anything getting hot because I'm not really getting anywhere at the minute. So let's do it on this cap here. And thermal cam. Okay. This is getting hot here. Yep. And uh, that is... Oh! Hmm. And that is the CPU. So I'm pretty sure this is game over. Would you add him and eat it?